Yo, what's going on guys? Many here and welcome to another episode of MMT. This is going to be done live on Twitch. If you're not already following the stream, the link for that is down in the description below as ever. Twitch, OF Manny. Um, right now, this is the squad that we have. But I was saying to my stream just now, I'm at the point where I just want to have fun. And using all these cards is fun. But at the same time, when you're not getting the results or like people are just going to try hard against you, you might as well use teams that are more fun, teams that people want to see. There's still a lot of prime moments that I haven't used so far. So I think right now what we're going to do is we're going to get selling. Zidane, absolutely love him. But at the same time, he's worth a lot of coins. And to make these teams, we need coins. So Zidane's going to go up for sell. Probably going to lose a lot of coins. But we knew that. I don't think anyone's going to buy him for 10 milli. But you never know. He's, he's going to be the only one. So I'm going to still list him for something like this. Zidane has to go. We're going to start by listing Zidane. Cruyff, I'm not going to lie, a card that I've had a lot of fun with. A lot of fun, but also, he's going to have to go too. We haven't even tried 99 Pele. And like I said, we're, we already know we're going to lose coins. That's just a fact. We're going to lose coins. That's Cruyff gone as well. I guess in that same breath, Maldini's got to go too. He's got to go. We're going to list these guys here. If someone wants a little deal on Maldini, there you go. I think he's up for 4.1, so we're not going to sell him at that. We'll list him. That's that's a whole mil plus we're losing on him. It is what it is. Not Cruyff. Nah, Cruyff had to go as well. The only one that I'm kind of thinking oh, I want to hold on to is Hullet. Cannavaro's going to have to go too. What team do you want me to build? I feel like I wanted to do a past and present Chelsea team. However, Chelsea's team isn't very high rated on this game. So, I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure. How much would it cost to make an Arsenal past and present? We would have... For an Arsenal past and present, we'd need... Lehman? Is this his moments card? Lehman. Sol Campbell. If I'm missing anyone, let me know. Prime moments Campbell. E. Who would you have? Oh, we'd need to get Vieira as well. But I didn't like the prime moments Vieira. I don't know why. Let me see how much he goes for. I didn't like him. I went for like 3.5 at the time as well. Ooh. Has anyone tried this Burkamp? I haven't tried him yet and I've heard he's pretty good. We've done a past and present Liverpool. But I want to do an upgraded one as well. That's what we're going to do. We're going to do like different squads over the next few weeks. I'll play against some of you guys. Rather than stressing over weekend league, it makes more sense in my head. Arsenal's winning. There's so many, Ar I swear there's so many Arsenal fans in this world. Would I have to have Petit at left back? Well, who's Arsenal's left back now? Would I have to get that left back Petit? Oh, Tierney. Oh, good shout. See, this is why I need you guys. And I've got Tierney as well. And who would you have right? No, did I miss that bearing? Is he gone? Oh, if he's gone, that's annoying. Oh, he's here, he's here. I'm, I'm gonna do that before. Does that go away or no? Oh, I need to do an 86 rated squad for this bearing. I can't now, I'll dash half of these cards in. Saving a Carter for when Icon SBCs come out. Icon SBCs probably aren't coming out. And if they do, then I'll be surprised. Okay, that's done. I know I could have done that cheaper, but I wanted to get that bear in real quick, so. We got him, 87 rated. Is he good? Has anyone used him? Player moments bear in, done. Apparently he's so good. Okay. Well, we got him. Oh, something sold, guys. What sold? Cannavaro? Yeah, I thought so. These might not sell this episode. That's the problem. So Dan might not sell. Cruyff might not sell, Maldini might sell, but I don't know, we'll see, we'll see. We could put this David Luiz centre back. What right mids do Arsenal have? Or do I change formation? Headliner or Bamiyan? This Henri, I was cussing him out so much. Will I have to buy him back again? I hope not. But you can't have an Arsenal past and present team without Henri. There was a stage where Henri was Arsenal. People are saying we could use Nabry at right mid. Don't buy Henri. He just ruins the chem bad. How are we going to make this work? Alexis flashback at left mid. Guys, how are we making this work though? <laughs> chem wise. Use Pepe fam. Do you know what? We'll have Nabry on the bench. Because he's just going to make it mad difficult. Should we put Harry Kane in there because he used to be an Arsenal fan? <laughs> uh, you guys said Pepe. 4-3-3. Could get Martinelli in there. Yeah, you could use Martinelli as well to be fair. Now I can use Nabry. But he wasn't really in Arsenal's team like that, if you think about it. 
Who do you want the final midfielder to be? Should we just do 90 Petit instead? How much is the 92 Petit? I bet he's like 1.5. Uh, he is 1.5. I was about to say 2 mil. So what do we do with Burkamp then? Or well, what formation do we go to in game? We can't leave Perez out. Cruyff selling, guys. We're going to have enough coins to make the team that we want. Goodbye. Zidane's not selling. If Zidane doesn't sell, I won't cry, you know. 8.9 milli, though. I reckon he will sell. So we could go with Henri and Aubameyang up front. Perez on the left. We can now buy Burkamp. I don't really want to buy him as that, though, because we're going to have to change him. We can get Petit. So now we've got Petit. We've got Petit and Vieira. We've got Omri up front. Isn't that Omri trash? Well, I I was so half and half on him before. I didn't really like him in terms of how he felt on the ball. But you can't have an Arsenal past and present team without Thierry Omri. That That is disrespectful. I'm not even an Arsenal fan. And I know that's disrespectful. You can't do an Arsenal team without Burkamp. No, you can't do it without Omri. Don't try it. Don't disrespect Omri. You know. You know if it was between Omri and Burkamp, Omri has to be there. So we're going to get Burkamp. We're going to get... We can get Headliner or Bamiang now. Or we could leave it like that. Zidane's not going to sell. Which I'm not going to complain about because I do like the card. So even if I can have Zidane and Hullet still, that's good. Cruyff, don't take long to sell. Guys, don't bid for so long. Just someone slap down 9.4. You know you want to. He's actually going to get him for that. Guaranteed million coins lost. Oh, 8.8. .8. Okay. Send back to my club. The Dan, see you later. Maldini didn't fancy going anywhere either, clearly. Someone bid 8.8. .8. I could get Welbeck. What, what good would that do me? 8.8, .8, that's not too bad. In terms of losing coins, I thought we'd lose the 4 mil plus. We went for 9.5. So losing over 700k guaranteed. Okay, I think it's done. It's done. All right, we've lost just over 600k probably. All right, cool. Crow sold, now we can buy Burkamp. We can get Headliner or Bamiyang now. Although it probably doesn't make sense to get him. We could probably just get the left middle Bamiyang. Do you know what? I'm gonna go pretty much basic on everything. I'm not gonna change much. All right, cool. Do we buy Bamiyang still? Yes or no? We have to, you can't have it without Bamiyang. What am I playing at? All right, we have to get him for 730, sigh. Just gonna lose so much coins on this guy. Why spend money for a sub you never use? No, we're gonna bring him on. We're not keeping this team. Maybe actually might play weekend league with it. Maybe. 730k on a Bamiyang. Lazy buying? Yeah. Sorry, we're at that stage in FIFA where I'm gonna buy lazy. All right, cool. That's the team done. That's the team done. Let's go. Invite me. Let's go. The rule's 3-0 and you quit. 3-0 and you have to quit. <laughs> Perez! Like he did against Liverpool. What, what kind of shot was that? It got deflected, I was about to say. I'll never forget that goal. They used it on the advert for years. Perez wrapped it and I'll never forget. Whoa! Is this what this Perez is on? He Pele's turned me. I don't even know what team this guy's got. How did they remove a feature where you could see your friend's team or your opponent's team in a friendly match? How do you remove a feature like that? What makes you break that? I don't understand. Oh, Omri says, see you later. And you've literally seen me right there. Is that Ndidi? Ndidi, literally. Just dispossessing Omri. Like he's not one of the greatest strikers, if not the greatest striker to grace the Prem. What do you guys think of this debate? I'm seeing like, I don't know if you saw when Drogba and Omri were trending on Twitter. Who did you actually think was better? Omri, Burkamp. This guy's standing strong right now. You don't even know what a question that is, it's Omri. Omri or Drogba? Igalo, Drogba. Drogba did it in the biggest game of his career against Bayern. But are you gonna say that one night makes him better than Omri? Do you think that one night makes Drogba better than Omri? Because people said Omri never turned up in big games. Does that play a part in it? What is going on here? I don't know. I don't know the answer to the question myself. Personally, I don't know if it's nostalgia or what. I would actually say Henri. Henri as he scores there. I didn't even mean that to be sweaty. You brought out your goalkeeper. I was always going to pass that ball before. 
Big Soul Campbell, referee. That is disgusting. Can't do that to Big Soul. Pepe. Pepe. Adebayo, Agbonlo, uh, Agbonlo is an ultimate team legend. Yeah, I'm replayed in big Prem games and scored against some of the best players around at that time. He used to make ordinary guys. No, no, really good guys, sorry, look ordinary. And you gotta think, Omri went to the Bernabeu and silenced it. How many people went to the Bernabeu and silenced it? Like, Omri, nah, you gotta put some respect on his name. Although he didn't like always score in finals and stuff, you can't say he's not a big game player. That Thierry Henry used to strike fair into other teams. Look at Vieira, the vacuum. So Campbell, he seems like a bit of a force. So far, yeah, like from feeling this team, my favorite player is, oh my gosh, this Henri. He's supposed to have like 96 pace. My favorite player so far is um, Petit. Henri, work camp, Henri. Omri! 2 0. You gotta put some respect on it, man. I don't I don't like the card in this game, I don't feel him. Personally. Like overall, there's just something, maybe I'm just putting pressure on him. I think I could just be putting pressure on him. Cause I know there's people that could be able to use this card like crazy if they had it. Oh! How did he get he got the drag back? How did he get back to get the second one as well? No. Oshman, Layman, we love it. All right, let's bring on uh, Aubameyang. Um, we can bring on Nabri as well. And we'll bring on Alexis Sanchez. Is Alexis Sanchez an Arsenal legend? Yes or no? That's a good question. Is Alexis Sanchez an Arsenal legend? Give me that. Set him free. Nice. Aubameyang. Back to Omri. I played it back to Petit, but it didn't go there. Nabri. Ah, oh, it just didn't settle. I've charged out. I've charged out. It's Haggy. Throwing on goal. Has he got the composure? Haggy with the ball roll. Oh, good finish. See you later. Bamiyang says, see you later. Vieira. No, man. <laughs> but Bamiyang's pass for Vieira was meant for Omri. Pele. You gotta shoot. Ah, unlucky, GG. Good game. Wasn't mad sweaty either. What do you guys think of Henri from watching him? How's Petit not scored this? The fake shot to get the guy out of the way. That's got to go in the corner. I don't know what he's playing at. All right, cool. Invite me again. Um, this time I might start with Aubameyang. This time we'll start with Aubameyang. He looked a bit deadly. I want a little bit more from this Burkham. Sam Mellis is the one that I saw come up. Hey, Jason's on point right now. Try 91 drug bar. I think I'm going to do the Milan team first, and then I'm going to do Chelsea after that. Man City past and present. Joey Barton's not in the game, is he? <laughs> what are your tactics, bro? I have it on key highlights when I do uh, FM stream, Mev. All right, let's go. Sam, let's have a good game. Let's see if this Omri wants to turn up. Big Soul Campbell, show me something. Big Soul Campbell, Bayern's there. Oh, he's gonna get the free kick. Soul Campbell should never let Mbappe go around him like that. I don't know what's going on there. He's got Ian Wright. Is that who you got from your icon thing? Surely Ian Wright's got to be a good finisher on this game. Not a bad strike. What a pass. <gasps> don't you dare, oh! Imagine, imagine, get him off the corner. Where's Perez? Perez, get on that. So Campbell. <sighs> Don't go anywhere, Rooney. On reason behind. What can he do? Oh, see you later. Oh. Oh, no. Go to the left more. We were looking at a decent goal there. Big Saul Campbell. Get to the ground, Mbappe. Take some of that. Your little crying celebration that everyone keeps using on Twitter, mate. Oh, Henri! Henri! Oh, come on, man. No. 
Vieira's all day. Perez. Perez! Oh! <laughs> I haven't really used that skill much on this game, you know. I haven't used that skill much. For one million, Daglish is good. Yeah. He's going for one mil now. Right. Uh, this Sol Campbell's alright as well. I have to say. Love that Pepe. Now play Aubameyang. Aubameyang. Finish it. Oh, no. Try a long shot with Petit. His shooting's mad. Vieira. Right. We're at half time right now. And to be fair, I'm enjoying using Perez a little bit. Aubameyang, very underwhelming. Very underwhelming. It's a tight game right now. It's only 1-0. Only one goal in it. And that could change. Ah, oh, of course the game won't let my David Luiz get to that ball, which he should be getting. Merton's almost getting the rebound there as well. Ah, oh, it just hooks behind people. Petit, let's try that long shot. Ah! Oh! Henri. Henri, you're right there. Bro. Don't tell me you brought on Ryan Kent as well. I'll be disappointed. Who's that on the far side? That's Messi. Okay, I was looking at that. Cut inside. Give me that. That's Big Saul Campbell, man. <laughs> that was deep, man. Solomon, you didn't have to do him like that. There you go. And again. Henry's made the run. Burkham! Oh! How did he recover that? Oh, what a kick. David Luiz. Game, don't do it. Game, don't do it. Look at it. Look at this game. Look at the state of it. Look at the state of it. How hard I had to try to change the player to my goalkeeper and he almost messed up. Petit in all that space. Burkamp! Burkamp! Oh! How are these? No way! Bicycle kick it, bro! It was set up! AC Milan. I think people want full AC Milan, past and present. Alright, that's two games down. Thank you guys who invited me. I appreciate you. Thank you. Good games as well. 1-0, I tried to score some nice goals, didn't really work. What was the goal that we got in this game? Perez, this was actually all right, you know. Came and did that thing. What? Boom, finesse, beautiful. Finesse from Perez, what do you expect? A player of class, a player that I can say I've played alongside. How many people can say they played alongside Perez? Look at that, beautiful, man. All right, guys, that is it for this episode of MMT. I appreciate you guys for watching. We've done an Arsenal team. I feel like the team could have been better, but obviously we were waiting to sell some players and stuff like that. The next team I'm going to do is going to be Milan. Just because I have Hullet and Maldini already. I could get Seydorf back. Um, but yeah, we're going to build Milan and then probably do Chelsea after that. And then hopefully, somewhere down the line, we'll be able to do a Real Madrid one, past and present. Because I'm still waiting on Moments R9 and he's just not on the market. So what can we do, really? What can we do? I don't know. But yeah, until next time, uh, leave a like on the video if you have enjoyed it. If you're not already following me on Twitch, as I always say, the link is down in the description below. Other than that, I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.